Good morning. We are so happy that you're here. Actually, it's afternoon. Um, we daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. Today is my very first day with Peter back to work. Just me and the kids. Everyone is in good spirits today, and we're feeling adventurous. So we are clinging to the shade today. It is almost 90 degrees in Chicago. Very hot. James is all sunscreened up, but this little one is too little for that. So we're gonna be in the shade. And you know me, I need to stay in the shade. James, he really does too, but he is like, he has that extra protection of the sunscreen. Um, but Mr. Teddy is just napping and we're hanging out. I was overwhelmed by today. Like I kind of, you know, I was expecting it to be um, just an overwhelming day. A lot of emotions with just Peter going back period, let alone it truly being my first time needing to meet the needs of two. Um, but what's so great is that Peter works from home. That's working in my favor. Um, and we can set the bar low. I was thinking like, oh, I want to get in this new routine. And I was telling myself like, as much as the new routine is exciting and important and will be helpful, as long as we just get through the day, that will be an A plus. So giving myself grace, made it to the park, which I was not sure if I would even attempt, but we did it. You see the, you see the garbage truck? So yeah, we are nearing Jamesy's nap time. So this is like our last bit of energy that we're gonna tire them out. Um, yeah, we're taking the day hour by hour. It is very warm, my cheeks are already pink. Um, so I don't know how long we'll last. I don't wanna get this little one too hot in the carrier. Um, but yeah, very big day. And I would say a good day so far. You are officially done with your first day back to work. How does it feel? Okay. <laughs> I definitely like not working. Yeah. <laughs> but so it went by fast. So it went by fast, and that was more so like trying to make sure like I have access to all my programs, my accounts, my emails, VPN. I was nervous that with us being like on the go for so many days that James wouldn't like go back to our normal nap routine, but he's been down for two hours. It did help that Peter could hold Teddy though. But we're taking advantage when we yeah. can. It won't be like that every day. Like I didn't right. have any meetings during the time that you put names down. Right. Actually, I did at one meeting, but it wasn't yeah. a, one that I was an integral piece of, so I was able to hold Teddy the whole time. Yeah. Got Lord of the Rings on? What? Goofy! 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 Christmas at the Disney World parks? Halfway there. Guys, we might be going to a Christmas party this year. They better announce it. Jamesy, ready to go shopping? Ready to go grocery shopping? Oh gosh. <laughs> Tell me what's more of a Monday thing than going grocery shopping after you get off work on a Monday. That's a pretty Monday thing to do. But I got from my man right here with me. I'm gonna knock it out. Quick veggies, quick produce. Maybe a sweet treat for this guy for being a, a good helper. Hey, hey. Get ready, Jamesy. Get ready. You want some of these sweet treats? See anything good? anything we're grabbing. James is doing pretty good. I'm pretty certain we got one of every single vegetable or fruit they offer here. Did we get one of almost every produce? Yes. Did we get every frozen fruit? Yes. Should I attend this? Yes. 
pretty impressed. The only two things I didn't have, which we can pick up later. Um, successful, successful trip. To Aldi. Whoop, almost missed the door. And just like that, we're done. We're out of here. Maybe we'll see a, a train for the subway. James loves it. Doesn't my hair look so funny after it was in a French braid yesterday? Um, anywho, coming at you with this poor lighting and angle and everything quality because I've been nurse trapped basically since the boys have left and like the sun has gone down and now the lights, now I need the lights on. Um, and the TV timer went off, so it's off because I was putting up the vlog. Um, basically this is the time of day where Teddy cluster feeds, which I have welcomed because I feel like it gives him a better night's sleep. So then we all get sleep and that's always good. So I will take being trapped on the couch for a little bit in the evening for that. Um, plus I got the notification. He's in like his first little leap. Um, and he's definitely growing and looking older. So that's what I've been doing. <laughs> Sorry. Who knows how much was even able to be vlogged at Aldi. It's always kind of hard to grocery shop and film with a toddler. So I just wanted to say hi. My friends are home. Here you go. Here you go. Did you hold this for me? Teddy, Teddy needs help. Oh, so nice. Do you want to hold him? Take him. I need you to take him. Take him. So not only was it my first day back to work, but it was also like, you know, why not on a Monday go back to work after four weeks and also decide to do a bunch of like responsible things like verify and increase your life insurance, both all the different kinds of life insurance. Why not submit a bunch of your child's life birth certificates and verify all the things like vision, health and dental coverage with a new family member add Teddy as a beneficiary to all my policies and whatnot, you know? Why not? Sounds like Monday morning kind of stuff, right? Work was like anticlimactic. I had a couple, just a few meetings, but um, because the weird way that my company works and how uh, leave works in America, I had to technically file for FMLA. That's how my company gets their like insurance policy to pay for my paternity leave while I was out. So actually everything got shut down all my access all my network drives everything and even though my boss like I submitted last week that I was coming back to get a kickstart a lot of the stuff still wasn't like fully initiated so I like had access to my emails for like a couple hours that was it then it got like weirdly shut off hopefully tomorrow it's better um I could access my teams and communicate with my team for a little bit but then that went sideways and then I was just like phoning into meetings um catching up with some people on how the past month has gone um so pretty pretty good day i mean better than james when when james was born i went back after just a, a two weeks um i couldn't do a thing i couldn't even log into my computer i actually had to go into the office to get them to reset it so at least i could log into my computer today uh which works out because i'm actually uh <laughs> james was just doing something he wasn't supposed to and i kind of reprimanded him for it and then he just went to go do it again and looked at me and i looked at him and he like dropped to the couch um so that's fun so there's, that was that was my Monday. That was my return back to work. I've got a bunch of like one-on-one -on -one meetings tomorrow to see how my people have been doing while I was out. Yay work. Look at that big head. I'm not even talking about James, I'm talking about Sarah. <laughs> Look at this Evie girl. He looks so cute. If you heard the music playing in the background, Peter's getting amped because he's going to see Dave Matthews Band with his brother. Also, Sarah's going to a concert. We're both going. This weekend. And Teddy. Not James. 
last minute. We're going to see Andrew. It's very loud. Um, Andrew McMahon opened for Billy Joel. We're going to see at Notre Dame. Too. Yeah. <laughs> but we're saying Andrew McMahon. <laughs> right. But what's so cool, and I'm sure I'm going to say it a million times, is that Andrew's very first concert was Billy Joel. And now he's opening for him. Neither of us have seen Billy Joel. I grew up hearing a lot of Billy Joel. I realize I know a lot more Billy Joel than I realized. Like, it was just on, but I didn't realize who it was. Also, my. Also. I think it must have been my sophomore year. I think my sophomore year, our marching band <laughs> did Billy Joel like songs for our field show. Jamesy's has been experimenting with um, throwing toys and Evie needed water. <laughs> is anybody, is anybody's dog at random just start licking them a lot? Do we think? <laughs> Did you get your head? Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. You all right? Oh gosh. <laughs> what a tough Monday. Wow. You make them dance? Evie randomly, I mean, she's always like giving us kisses, but like recently she's been obsessed with like licking <laughs> so goofy yeah she's been like licking my legs licking my arms i don't know if it's like uh like if she has anxiety or if she thinks i need it i don't know comment below if your dog has ever started doing that this little get up teddy is in is so stinking cute he's just been snoozing on me while i edit the vlog Peter cleaned up toys and is rocking some dishes right now. I think the theme of a very Monday, Monday, is continuing. Um, but really we're just like getting back into the swing of a routine. I will eventually film like a new a day in the life vlog as far as like what we like, like find ourselves doing within the day, but Today was day one. I definitely do not have anything down pat yet. And honestly, even when I film that, it's gonna be like, it's gonna be like how I did last time where I say like, sometimes things go like this and some days things go like that. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely film that eventually. I don't I don't believe that we mentioned that. Jamesy went down to bed great. Um, Another thing I don't think we end up touching on was that we plan on going to Disney at Christmas time this year for Teddy's first trip to go to a Christmas party. As long as like it goes well with our plans and they have them, um, we will be going to a party, which we have not gone to in quite some time. Um, so that's super exciting. So a trip announcement will be coming soon. Back to being a worker. <laughs> a worker bee. Yeah. Oh gosh. Do you get that other one starting? We were hoping we could just transfer him from the <laughs> Dakotat into his, the bassinet and it sounds like it was false. <laughs> it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>